Hello again, this is Captain John with another one of my video tips of the week. If you sail onto a course higher than a broad reach, your sailboat will slip sideways in a condition called leeway. Vessels on close hauled courses experience more leeway than those on reaches. Higher wind velocities cause more leeway, and lighter shallow draft sailboats will experience more leeway than those of medium or heavy displacement. Here we have the wind out of the west, and we are on a beam reach on a course of 0, 0, 0. We can expect the wind to push us to the right or to the east toward the coast. Follow these three steps to help you compensate for leeway and stay in safe water when coastal cruising. Sail 10 to 15 degrees to windward of the sailing track line. Avoid the temptation to ease the sheets when reaching. Keep steering upwind until within sight of your objective. Use your GPS latitude and longitude coordinates to help you stay in safe water. Here we plotted a longitude line and labeled it 124 degrees, 37 minutes west. We've laid this line far enough off the coast to clear all dangers. As we sail to the north, we'll keep an eye on our GPS. As long as we keep to the west of this line, we'll stay in safe water. Scan your chart and look for depth contours along the coast. In the illustration, you can see that the 20 fathom curve clears all shoals to the east. Highlight and label this curve and then watch your depth sounder. Keep in water deeper than 20 fathoms as you sail to the north. Use these three sailing navigation tips to help you compensate for leeway when sailing or cruising. This is Captain John, and this has been another one of my video tips of the week. Find more sailing tips and techniques on www.skippertips.com.